This is Tony from Creative Chica Halls. Maybe I should change my little intro a little bit. Mm -mm. Like step it up a little bit. I don't know. Anyway, so I went to Dollar General because I was checking to see if they have any Easter stuff. I do not need any more Easter stuff, guys. I've got to like stop it. Stop, 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 stop. Stop in the name of love. Yes, I need to stop, okay? Because I have plenty of Easter stuff on this long counter now, okay? I have plenty enough. And I just hope that Dollar General doesn't come out with cute stuff because it's hard to resist, guys. But anyway, so um, I went to Dollar General. This is a Dollar General haul, you guys. And I found this. And I thought it was cute. And it says, oh, I don't know. Anyway, it says, this house has catitude. Which yesterday, we had a new visitor yesterday. It was like, it looks like a Persian black cat, just absolutely gorgeous, laying out there on our patio. And I told my husband, I said, do you think I should try to feed him? Him or her or whatever? So he came over and ate a little bit, but then he left. But he had the cutest little meow. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. So anyway, I bought this, but I'm probably going to take it back, guys. I don't really need it. So, you know, I don't know. I was going to give it to somebody, but I, uh... I just already sent the package off. So maybe I'll send, I'll save that for next time. <laughs> I do that sort of thing. It's like, Tony, what is wrong with you, girl? So anyway, um, I bought these little solar dancer characters. It's the little gnomes. Now, I don't know how much I paid for these. I don't know whether I got them for 50% off or not. No, it was on Monday, so I didn't. But that's okay. But it says love on there, so I thought those was cute. So, you know, friend mail, stuff like that. I thought that would be cute. I don't know. I'll probably keep one for myself because that's how I am. <laughs> I like cute little stuff like that. Okay. And then I found this cute little Mickey Minnie. No, it's not Mickey. It's Minnie Duck. Isn't that adorable for a dollar? It was sitting up there with the gnomes and I couldn't resist her. So, she's so cute. Cute. So, you know. Put on my two-tier tray, three-tier tray in my room probably. Okay, so... Here's my receipt from Dollar General to put, you know, I got to scan it on my Fetch. If y'all don't have Fetch, be sure you get, you know, you download that Fetch app because you can get, you can, you know, you download this and then you start scanning your receipts and then it builds up and builds up and then you get gift cards for $10, $25, depends on how much you've been spending for all kinds of different stores, restaurants, just all kinds of things. So, yeah. It's a great idea, guys. Great idea. Okay, so I went to the Dollar General. This is still a Dollar General haul. And um, this was like a, from a few Dollar General guys. It's not from just one. I've noticed that a lot of the Dollar Generals, they carry different things for some reason. I mean, like, I go to mine and I find things and then I, I don't see, and then I go to another one and I see things there that I didn't see at mine, so it's kind of weird. Anyway, so I picked up this little Mountain Dew. I guess I collect the little lip balm, blah, bombs now, but this is the Mountain Dew, and I just love little things like that. It's so stinking cute. Hang up on my wall or whatever. So I thought that was cute. For two bucks, I got that. So my grandson's birthday um, is coming up, and I found these. This is uh, by Mattel. It was $8 and something, and it is the Batman, and it is... Extreme bendable figures. Okay, so I got the Batman right here. I think he he and his brother are going to have fun with these because I got the Batman one for his birthday, and I got Superman, so he can pick out whichever one he likes and give the other one to Bubby. But I thought they were cute to put in his birthday bag, and um, you remember the Stretch Armstrongs? Yeah, like I think. My son who passed away, he bought them uh, some of the Stretch Armstrong toys last year. Like last, not this past Christmas, but the year before. And um, they really like those. So these are just going to be like bendable things. So they can bend them in all different like ways, as you can see right here. So they'll have fun for that with that. Now on the back, it shows that they have Superman, Batman, another Batman. They had like a, a Batman in the black, but I prefer the blue for my grandson. They have the Joker, the Flash. Look at that. Oh my gosh. So if you can find these at your Dollar General, go pick them up. Cute, huh? So I said, I never saw these before. I'm going to pick them up for the grand boys. 
grandsons, grand boys. Oh my gosh. Okay, so um, I found I've been looking for this particular type of tie dye. I've been looking for it for years. They never had my size, so they finally had my size extra large in this color here, and it was fourteen dollars. These used to be twelve dollars, guys. So now they're fourteen. But look how beautiful the pink is. It's got a gator on it, a gator chomp chomp, Florida, Florida. So yeah, but honestly, I actually went to Florida. Is it what's it called up there in Gainesville to the college up there? Because I went to be a dental assistant, but it was only for two weekends. But it was all paid and everything, motel, everything, food, everything, and uh, to become a certified dental assistant. <laughs> That's my college, guys. I went for two weekends, but hey. Hey, I graduated at the Florida, Florida, whatever it's called, Florida State University. <laughs> so anyway, I got this. It's extra large, and I love the color. It's so bright and cute. So yeah, you know, I guess I collect t-shirts, guys. Evidently, I collect them. I love t-shirts. I used to not wear them, but I love them. I live in them. So anyway, so um, they're at Dollar General. They have a good variety of Easter candy, cookies, stuff like that. So I'm getting stuff together for my grandson's birthday, uh, Easter basket, not birthday, because I got birthday going on as, as well. So I got these for them. I got them a bag each. They're called um, Mother's, it's called Limited Batch Springtime Circus Animal Cookies. They got ducks, bunnies, butterflies, and chicks. Aren't those cute? So these were like $3.75 each. So I picked up two of these. And it's a net weight of nine ounces. And it's just cookies. So I thought that would be cute to put, for, you know, give them for Easter. So I really need to find other things to put in their Easter basket besides candy, guys. I really, really do. So I do have um, a couple of uh, bunnies I'm going to put in there. Okay, so I picked these up, um, more candy, and these were like $3 for this bag, guys. Now, you go to Walmart, and you're going to spend like $6.96, but the bag might be a little bit bigger, but these were like $3, like I said. I think they were $3. I don't know for sure, guys. I know something. I think it was $3. Anyway, these have Kit Kat, Robin Eggs, and Reese's Peanut Butter. So I got this, and I'll probably, um, you know divide this up into some little Easter bags and put it in their Easter bucket because they don't need this whole big bag. And I will probably be sending some of this stuff out in Happy Mail. That's what I'm thinking. So I bought these little Tiger Pops and they love their little suckers. The ones that I got them for uh, Valentine's Day, the Mandalorian and the Child. I bought those at, you know, they're the little flip suckers. Man, they love those things. And um, so I got these little lollipops for them because I told them, I said, I'll get you some more lollipops. These are the Tiger Pops. And these, it says New Shapes, 18 lollipops. And I think, I don't know how much, these might have been $3. They might have been 2 They give you get cherry, blue raspberry, and watermelon. So I don't have my receipt handy or I would tell you. But anyway, so I thought those would be cute for them for Easter because they like the, the lollipops. And then... Um, I found these little, they're uh, chocolate, chocolatey covered marshmallow bunnies, and um, they're 1.87 ounce, and I don't know if they like those or not, but I bought them one each because I thought they were stinking cute, so I bought that for them for their Easter basket. I'm probably going to get them their little Easter basket at Dollar Tree. They got some really cute ones, and I, whenever I went to the big Dollar Tree, I passed them up. But hopefully mine will get them down there. But they're about this tall. Like they're really tall. And they're, they got like a bunny on them. And they got them in blue and pink. And they're really cute. So I do want to get that for them probably. Put all of their Easter stuff. And you know honestly. Honestly. I really should save these for Easter. That's what I really should do. Instead of give it to him for his birthday. Because he's got enough stuff going on for his birthday. So I think I'm going to put this in the Easter basket. Sorry bubs. You're not getting it for your birthday. Okay. So I picked, and I hope that he's not watching because sometimes mama puts me on and lets him watch. And, you know, I don't want them to see what I'm getting them. But it don't really matter, does it? <laughs> They'll probably forget about it. <laughs> 
So anyway, I found these cute little uh, eggs, and I bought the blue ones, you know, because, you know, boys in blue and all that. These are little M&M's uh, eggs. they got M&M's in them, and they've got the girl. No, this one's got the girl on there with, in the green M&M, and this has got the yellow guy on it. But I think it's just plain M&M's. Milk chocolate. Milk chocolate. So I thought that would be cute in their little Easter basket. Okay. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, these allergies are terrible. Okay, I'm almost done with my last haul here, so that's good. That's good. <laughs> so I was looking for pom-poms, and I found these. I don't know. I bought it for the little white ones, but then I went to the other stores and found more. So I'm probably going to take these back. But anyway, these are pom-pom 75 count. Uh, oh, it's Valentine's Day crafts. <clears throat> oh, boy. Well, I may just keep them. Whatever. I'll just keep them. So, anyway, guys, that is all of my haul. And I appreciate everybody for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Please give me a big thumbs up. That helps my channel to grow. And I appreciate each and every one of y'all for stopping by and spending a little bit of time with me today. And I will catch you all in my next video. Bye, guys. Love y'all. See you later.